Yeah, we had a little bit of dusting here in the metro area. Going to find uh, some uh, breezy conditions, too. If you could look closely, the camera kind of shaking off and on out there. Plenty of clouds right now. 30 northwest wind sustained at 17, but we have had gusts around 30 this morning. So the wind chill at 18 degrees. Got to watch out for those driveways and sidewalks this morning. A little bit of ice on there, so want to take your time on your morning commute. Current conditions statewide. Lower 20s up north, of course, where we have uh, some higher snowpack. Temperatures are going to stay a little bit cooler up there. Some blowing snow still possible early. Uh, some flurries being reported around Waterloo and then uh, Lamoni and Ottumwa mainly dry right now, right around 30 degrees. That wind will get you this morning again. Gusts between 25 and 35 miles per hour. Uh, so with those wind chills again, feeling like the single digits, especially up in the northern parts of the state. Mason City at nine. Ames feeling like 15 degrees in Creston waking up right around 15. So definitely want to bundle up if you're heading off to work and the kids for school this morning. Maybe that hot breakfast on the table will be a good idea. 28 by 9 a.m. I think the clouds will stay pretty thick early today. And then as we get into the afternoon, again, still going to remain breezy, but we should see the clouds break apart a little bit. So getting a little bit of sunshine in here and in the overnight, the wind will start to lighten up, but the clouds will start to increase once again, and we could see maybe some flurries overnight. Not much in the way of moisture uh, with this next little wave of energy that will push in the overnight hour. So there's your midday temperatures again, keeping it cooler up to the north. The wind stays with us early today and then we'll lighten up in the overnight hours. There's that band of clouds I was talking through overnight tonight. Uh, may give us a few flurries in the evening and overnight hours, but it'll quickly move out of here tomorrow morning. Waking up 8 o'clock 26 here in the metro upper teens up north. That's where the coolest air will be, but the good news is we'll get that sunshine back for tomorrow and temperatures are actually going to warm up a little bit and the thaw will continue here for the next several days. 50 on Thursday, lower 50s on Friday, so a beautiful uh, start to the weekend, even above uh, freezing on Saturday and on Sunday. Temperatures will take a dip there uh, just a few days coming in Sunday, Monday, and then we're back to near 50 on Tuesday. So I'll tell you what, that eight day stretch not yeah. looking bad, especially January temperatures yeah. where we should be. That's